Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 7. Today we're going to be talking about the new set photos. We have set photos of Bart Allen, The Flash, Nora West Allen, and also a bunch of Godspeed. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so the other day I did my video on the first look at Bart Allen. This was from the same day where they released a couple of set photos, but now so many more set photos have been released. This is all coming from Canada Graphs and also Themyscira Bound. So I'll leave the relevant links in the description below to their sites. So I'm going to be reading through Canada Graphs' blog mainly, and we're going to be going through his photos, and we got a couple of photos from Themyscira Bound. And they all show like different angles and perspectives of what is going to be happening in the Flash's 150th episode. But for now, click right here to watch that video where we broke down Bart Allen's first look. So we talked about his suit and how comic book accurate it is and everything else surrounding it. But yeah, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. So we're going to go to Cannon Grass's blog and we're going to read it out. So the Flash was on location for season 7 shooting on Friday morning for episode 17. This episode was directed by Eric Dean Stanton. He did the Exorcism of Nash Wells episode last season. Also, he's done like a bunch of other ones. So on this day, they had three locations. The first was a small, quiet, rarely used side street, not far from the location they used for the Star Labs exteriors. And just a block down the road from where Abracadabra died earlier this season at the hands of Fuerza. This early morning shoot had Grant Gustin as The Flash, along with returning star Jessica Parker Kennedy along with the recently announced new addition to the cast, Jordan Fisher, as Bart Allen, aka Impulse. For this scene, they started with stunts, as the stunt double for Impulse did a scene where he and one of the several Godspeeds that were on set are thrown across the pavement. Both of them face off, but soon Impulse finds himself surrounded by a gang of six Godspeeds. They raise their arms up, and Impulse cowers, and he sort of lowers to the ground, and then the Godspeeds just leave. A moment later, XS and The Flash come in, and they have a family chat. So, these were most of the scenes that were done, and that's the kind of general gist that the blog gives us about the day as a whole, and the photos that you've been seeing, and we're gonna properly break down now, correlate to this. So, let's go ahead and break down these photos. So, this is a photo right here, and this is just a behind the scenes shot of Grant and Jordan on set, fully suited up in their costumes, and I have to say, it's so cool seeing them all teamed up together and having like this big Flash family moment. And so it's clear in this episode that it's going to be pivotal that they all work together and obviously the main threat is Godspeed and that's what they're going to be working towards stopping. But yeah, let's briefly touch on Bart Allen's suit once again. Man, it's so cool. I really love the suit. It is quite metallic, quite grey on the side, mixed with a bit of white. And I really like the texture throughout the suit, especially on the chest, because the lightning bolt I think is made even better by that kind of golden texture they have there. Also, they've gone fully comic book accurate, like I mentioned in my other video, with the mask, with the cow, and like the way he has the yellow goggles. That is awesome. And just as a whole, I'm super excited to see more of this. Okay, so... If we go chronologically throughout Canada Graphs' blog description and also his photos, you see Bart by himself at first, and so you have the standoff at him kind of at the side of the street. And at this point, he's definitely met Barry and Nora because they do have that family chat after the Godspeeds disappear. However, he is out alone. I would presume maybe he is chasing after one of the Godspeeds, and that's what you see in this photo right here with the Godspeed kind of just arriving. That is that kind of slide in pose they do when you have speedsters running into a certain spot. And Bart is on the ground, aka Jordan Fisher, and you have a few of these photos where he is being confronted, and so this is a cool one. They are basically standing off. Bart stares at one of the Godspeeds, and this leads into what happens next, where Bart is surrounded by those Godspeeds, and there is six of them, and as you can see in the photos, they all put their hands in the air, and they're just replicating each other. Obviously, these are Godspeed clones, so we don't know who the true Godspeed is. However, they are definitely going to be the main villain of the back half of the season, and this is going to be the reason why Bart Allen comes back in the first place. He's going to be trying to stop Godspeed. 
I would presume maybe the real Godspeed comes from the future, maybe at the same time as Bart Allen and Nora, and that's why they've come back because they know of this threat, and they know that they're coming back to the past in order to gain infinite velocity and they've come back to stop that and Bart is obviously scared because he is surrounded by six god speeds and you can see them literally all about to do the facing hand trick that reverse flash is known for they're about to kill Bart Allen that is what they are doing and obviously they're gonna kill him but then somehow siphon and speed I don't know what their specific way of doing that is however I guess that is a valid question we have to ask do you think Bart Allen could potentially be on the chopping block? Like, is there a possibility in one version of a timeline that Bart Allen dies and maybe like Barry goes back in time and erases it and starts again? I guess that could be a possibility if there is so many Godspeeds and it's so hard to defeat them because from all these behind the scenes photos, we know that it's really tough and we need all of Flash family in order to try and even defeat them. And so we go on to the next photo and you got this kind of close-up photo of them and they are all doing the same pose. But this time they have both hands up in the air and it kind of reminds me of that scene back last season where you had Godspeed saying, I am here for your velocity, I want infinite velocity. And so it does seem like they are replicating each other's actions and they are probably talking to him right here being like you will die impulse and then after this they quickly move on to the hand phasing and so throughout this whole scene as the blog says Bart Allen is cowering in fear and he's always on the ground or near to the ground and then suddenly all the godspeeds disappear I would have to presume they are chased away probably by the Flash and Nora and obviously in the scene, they're not going to be showing it when they're filming because that would be a CGI scene where you would have the Godspeeds chasing after the Flash and the XS. That's just my theory about why they disappear so suddenly, but I'm nearly 100% sure that they are thwarted by Barry and Nora showing up. And so as you can see right here, Jessica Parker Kennedy is back as Nora West Allen. Super exciting to see set photos of her. Her suit is exactly the same as before and she is once again reunited with her father and mother and I'm still interested to see if there is any changes to her character but from just strictly appearance wise she looks exactly the same so maybe we can theorize that she is the exact normal version of Nora we saw in season 5 rather than an alternate timeline version of Nora who has been completely changed because normally they would like signify it in terms of looks I don't know if her lightning is still the same obviously that's the thing you'll see in post-production when we get closer towards the episode but she's back she is here with Barry and so they are here they are saving a cowering Bart Allen as you can see who is near to the ground and shortly after this they have that family talk and so you can see them giving a talking to Bart. I would presume they're saying, what are you doing, Bart? Why did you go after all these Godspeeds or, you know, like one Godspeed? And I presume he's explaining kind of what happened and why they had to come and save him. But it seems like some sort of pretty intense conversation in terms of family talk. And so we cut to this photo and this is the last one from Canada Graphs. This is just them talking. I'm not sure if this was actually during a take. I'm presuming this is just behind the scenes stuff because they're there and two of the Godspeeds are in the foreground. So yeah, the Godspeed thing is going to be playing out over the last bunch of episodes throughout the season. Obviously like a month ago or so or maybe even a bit further back, we got the first look at Godspeed returning to the Flash on the set. So expect like four to five episodes maybe of Godspeed. I would say probably more likely to get four and we'll get some teases in some other episodes of what Godspeed is planning. However, it's going to get big towards the end of the season and you're going to have Team Flash, Flash family all working together to take down Godspeed. You're going to have Bart Allen showing up for the first time and Nora returning also Jay Garrick returning so it's going to be huge and also they are said to appear in the next episode after this in the season finale for season 7. But let's go ahead and talk about the next couple of photos. We've got a few from Themyscira Bound. One right here is a behind the scenes look of Jordan in his impulse suit. 
And again, I have to reiterate how cool the suit is, and I think you guys are really gonna like it, and we got some good response on my last video. So, obviously, we're gonna be covering a lot, and there is a lot of theories I have about Bart Allen and going into this episode, and also the finale, and potentially season 8. So, as always, give your input in the comments below. Do you have any theories about him showing up, and what it could potentially mean for the future of The Flash, like in season 8? I'm always interested to hear, and I always read the comments. But the final photo we have is this, again from Themyscira Bound, this is Bart and Nora talking. And now, I'm not sure from this angle if this is like a different conversation scene, but from the looks of it, it could be the same, but it also could be very similar. But you can see they're actually conversing in a proper conversation, so I presume they are filming this. And so Bart has got his hands out, and he seems like he is explaining something to Nora, who seems kind of a little bit shocked. Or that's the way I kind of read her expression. But it seems like there will be some family squabbling in this episode, and I think that is mainly because the stakes are so high with all the god speeds around. So that's about it for today's video, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have liked what you've seen, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, subscribe and turn on the notifications if you're new, click right here to watch one of my newest videos, and for now, I'll catch you guys later, goodbye. I see red.